think there was a toddler also. The toddler was not short, it was a uh, Oh, but he died, he or she died. But it died after the time they went to Doctor or to Kalapo. What was it like? The name was Tosha. Tosha. Okay. <laughs> so what am I going to say? These two so, pilots. Yeah. These pilot. two pilots were the entrance to Mamelodi. The top part was broken by the statue of King Nyabela when it was taken from Bonnerbaum to Ross Seneca. Okay. And this statue here is the first statue in the country to be unveiled. And you can see it's the first commemoration in the country, pre-94. Mm -hmm. This one. And it was made by donations from the community. So we popped out something like 10 rands. It was a lot of money. And we got a local welder to do that thing. Uh, we were disappointed when we made this part It was a symbol of the resistance of the time. So it disappeared for some time and then it came back with that hole. And then the sun came and unveiled it. So we just put it there. And then it disappeared, then Chris Army came, and then they had the answer. No more questions? Okay. So after the the, the march the, on, on that day, what were the resolutions? What was the final conclusion? Like what did the leadership and the community and every everyone who was involved, what did they decide? on doing did you get um all your your, your cries being answered or no. was it just left just like that no because the memorandum was not handed over but it formed a parents committee I don't remember what the name of the parents committee but the parents were now involved in politics we are no longer a good thing we came also the parents and we had the mamelodi youth organization mayo who were at the forefront. And then we started with the peace gardens and we started with the community thing. What do what you call it? We started with the people's court where the, all the issues were taken. And from November until February, there was not a single event or incident of crime. After February, when all the people who were running the people's court were arrested, then the crime started to rampant again. Okay. So, um, personally, from your own uh, experience, being involved in an event of this calibre, how would you say it affected you um, as an individual? As an individual, it attracted me in that. Well, one thing that it did it was to unify the community. And another thing that it did, it showed us we can be crime free. And another thing it showed us we can take care of our things because one other thing, the dustbins were not taken. The, the rubbish bin were not taken. So there was a local community thing initiative to remove rubble and rubbish to the place where they was found. The, the Mamelodi Massacre event was on the 21st November 1985 because that's where the, most of the people were congregated next to the municipality. 